This is not financial advice, not legal advice for entertainment educational purposes only. Anything I say is my opinion. Please don't make any financial decision based on anything I say in these videos. That being said, hit the like button, subscribe button, all that YouTube algorithm stuff. So you get a video when I put them out. See what I'm thinking, see my analyzing that data. But like I tell y'all every day, the day they release us is false, man. It gives us a false narrative of the month so we can make bad trading decisions. Adam Aaron's been tweeting away, tweeting away. He uh, said that we broke we broke records for the most concession sales in the weekend. And then he tweeted that we had we broke another record, the most concession sales in a day. And these are great catalysts for AMC. I mean, we're making money hand over fist. We're breaking records. So why are we still in debt? We've had billion dollar movies. Billion dollars in ticket sales, and we know that the, the profit on the concessions is way higher than the profits on, on on movie tickets. Because I mean, how much how much does it really cost for a tub of popcorn? Twenty cents? And you sell it for ten dollars? How much does a soda cost you? Twenty cents? You sell it for five dollars, six dollars? So the profit margin on the concessions is a whole lot higher than the profit on movie tickets. So therefore, there has to be billions of dollars in profit. Where is this money going? And here's the other thing. You claim that there are no counterfeit shares. You claim that, 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 that there are no counterfeit shares. There's no evidence of it. But with all these positive catalysts, and you see that there are more buys than sells, why isn't the price of AMC going up, Adam Aaron? Why? We have all these positive, positive catalysts where we're breaking records all over the place. And we're breaking records in concession sales where the profit is through the roof. Yet, the price of AMC doesn't go up. But you say that there's no fraud and manipulation in the market when it comes to AMC. The f evidence of fraud and manipulation is entirely overwhelming. Anybody who doesn't want, who doesn't see it, rather, is because they don't want to see, because they close their eyes to the fraud and corruption. As far as I'm concerned, based on all the evidence I've seen over the last two years, the evidence is overwhelming of fraud and corruption in AMC and GME and a lot of the MEM stocks. You can tell by the threshold list. You can tell by the fail to deliver. You can tell by the dog pool volume. You can tell by all the spoof and all the washing and all the other things that they do to suppress the price. And right now, we have our CEO tweeting that we're breaking records, yet the stock doesn't move. But he claims there's no manipulation. There's no fraud. Anyway, please leave some comments. Tell me what you think. Do you think there's fraud and corruption in AMC when we're breaking all these records, but the stock is not moving and AA claims there's no counterfeit shares? Anyway, have a great day. God bless, and I appreciate y'all on this journey with me.